This story is from Genesis chapters 1 and 2. Long ago, God made everything out of nothing. First, God made the world and he began to fill it with beauty. God said, let there be light. And right away, light shone all around. God knew it was good. He parted the light from the darkness and he called the light day. He called the darkness night. Evening came, then morning, and the world was one day old. On the second day, God said, let there be sky, and the sparkling blue heavens appeared. Evening came, and then morning. The world was two days old. Next, God said, waters, gather together so dry land can appear. And the waters obeyed. God called the waters seas, and he called the dry land earth. God liked what he saw. It was good. Now, God said, let plants and trees grow up out of the earth, each with its own kind of seed. And pop, 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 plants with colorful, crunchy vegetables and sweet-smelling flowers sprang out of the ground. Trees grew tall and bloomed with delicious fruit. God liked what he saw. It was good. Evening came, then morning. The world was three days old. Now on the fourth day, God decorated the sky. Let there be lights in the heavens, he said. God made the sun for the day and the moon for the night. And he made the stars, so many stars that only he could count them all. God knew it was good. Evening came, and then morning. The world was four days old. On the fifth day, God said, now for the living creatures. First, let's fill the seas and the heavens. Let there be big and small creatures to swim in the seas and birds to fly through the air. Swish, splash, swoosh. Fish and turtles and whales and other sorts of creatures swarm through the seas. And birds winged their way over the earth. God liked what he saw. It was good. Evening came and then morning and the world was five days old. On the sixth day, God said, let there be animals on the earth. He made every kind of animal that lives on land, from the roaring jungle lion to the galloping zebras, the tall giraffes, the wiggly, wiggly desert lizard. God saw that it was good. But God had saved the best for last. Now the world was ready for people. Let us make people in our image, God said. They will take care of this beautiful world and all the living creatures and animals. So God made a man and a woman, Adam and Eve, and he blessed them. Evening came, and then morning, and the world was six days old. Everything God had made was very good, especially his man and woman. On the seventh day, God rested.